Charlottesville Albemarle Airport is getting millions of dollars in new federal funding. One part will make landing smoother, one will make flying safer, and the third will be something you can see from your car. Kate Nectarline is live in the newsroom with our top story at 5. Hi, Kate. Maggie, the airport is getting $2.9 million to make critical improvements. Plans are already in the works, but a spokesperson says they do not know when construction will begin. And just to make sure that our passengers are as safe as possible, we want to make sure that uh, we have the most up-to-date equipment. A nearly $3 million grant from the federal government means three things for Charlottesville's airport. Updated security, a repaved runway, and a new control tower to replace this one. We're working on how we're going to use the upgrades for the um, security system. Then, of course, um, the new tower will be completely new um, with the building and everything like that. So in order to do that, um, those funds will be delegated for those. Stuart Key is the airport's spokesperson. Our tower is one of the oldest ones in Virginia, we're told. Um, it's from 1970. And so just being able to give our FAA staff uh, something new to to uh, use and then of course um, maybe even a different view. As part of the 2021 bipartisan infrastructure law, the Federal Aviation Administration has provided $9 billion to airports across the country. Key says this is the third time Charlottesville has reaped the rewards of the legislation. So some of the projects that we've worked on um, in the last couple of years, we put in a new cover walkway system um, out from long term to the terminal and we also replaced our um, uh, escalators. Key says she hopes the money will make for a safer and more efficient travel experience. One of the biggest things for us is making sure that this airport is convenient for our passengers, so we will do everything we can to make sure that um, it doesn't interfere with their travel. Key says she does not know exactly when travelers will be able to see these changes, but most of the projects are slated to wrap up within the next two to five years. Live in the newsroom, Kate Nectarline, 29 News at 5.